Winnie the Pooh was walking through the forest one day. He had made up a little hum that very morning. And while he was humming to himself, he suddenly saw a large hole. Aha, said Pooh, if I know anything about anything. The hole means rabbit, he said. And rabbit means company, he said. And company means food and someone to hum to. So he put his head into the hole and called out. Is anybody at home? No, said a voice. Who took his head out of the hole and thought to himself, There must be somebody there because somebody must have said no. So he said, Rabbit, is that you? Rabbit used a different voice this time and said, <coughs> Oh! Do you think Rabbit was home? Let's read on and see. Could you tell me where Rabbit is? asked Pooh. He has gone to see his great friend Pooh Bear. But this is me, said Pooh. Oh, really, said Rabbit. Well, come in. Pooh pushed his way through the hole. When he got in at last, guess what he saw? Yep, it was Rabbit. Honey or jam with your bread, asked Rabbit. And Pooh got so excited that he said both. And then, so as not to seem greedy, he added, But don't bother about the bread, please. For a long time after that, he said nothing. He was too busy eating. Nom, 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 nom. Then in a rather sticky voice, he hummed Rabbit the little hum he had made up earlier. Then it was time to go home. Pooh started to climb out of the hole. He pulled and pushed. And in a little while, his nose was out. And then his ears. And then, oh, help, said Pooh. What's happened to Pooh? Would you like to read on and see? Since his front door was blocked, Rabbit went out through the back door. Are you stuck, he asked Pooh. No, said Pooh, just resting. Here, I'll pull you, said Rabbit. Ow, cried Pooh. You are stuck, said Rabbit. Pooh asked in a very sad voice. Could you call Christopher Robin? And so Rabbit did. And when Christopher Robin saw Pooh and said, Silly old bear. With so much love, everybody felt quite hopeful again. We'll just wait a week for you to get thin. I can't stay here for a week, cried Pooh. Yes, you can, said Christopher Robin. It's getting you out, which is so difficult. But I'll stay here with you and read you books. And so he did. Until the day came when he jumped on his feet and said, Now! He held on to Pooh's front paws. Rabbit held on to Christopher Robin. All Rabbit's friends also held on to Rabbit and they pulled. Pooh said, Ow! Then he said, Ouch! Then came a loud pop! And finally, Pooh was free. Yay! 
just in time to share a snack of honey and condensed milk. But this time, they all stayed outdoors. The end.